So in this video, we're going to be looking at the general solution of cos of 3x equals 1 half. We're going to be doing it in degrees, and we're going to be doing it in radians. So first things first is you inverse cosine both sides. So 3x is equal to inverse cos of 1 half. So inverse cos of 1 half is 60 degrees. Okay? So make sure you put the 3x equals 60 degrees. 60 degrees is the alpha that we were using before. So that means that in general, we've got 3x is equal to 360n, because remember that's the period of cosine, and we want multiples of it, plus or minus alpha, which is 60 degrees. So then we just divide through by 3, so x is equal to 120n plus or minus 20. And that's my general solution in degrees. For radians, so inverse cosine both sides. Inverse cos of 1 half in radians is pi over 3. So that means 3x is 2 pi n, because that's the period of cosine in radians. So 2 pi n plus or minus alpha, which is pi over 3. Then divide through by 3. And you could write that as 2 thirds pi n, or 2 pi over 3 times n, or however. So 2 pi over n over 3, plus or minus pi over 9. So here's your degrees, here's your radians. Once you get used to it, it's actually really, really straightforward. 